Uh, so I just want to give a quick demo of uh, ZBrush and Photoshop. Um, I was only able to get touch key working and not art dock and it doesn't seem to work well with the control and alt keys um, plus the side button on the pen is not uh, programmable that I know of and for me this is an issue because I use that as the alt key to navigate in ZBrush um, or on the model that I'm working on so if anybody knows of a way to program that or a way to get um, art dock working that would be a huge help uh, this is my first surface device so I don't know um, if it's the same as a surface 3 or, or what the situation is I'll have to dig deeper into that but let me <clears throat> go ahead and fire it up and show you guys um, I'm going to undock it first <laughs> All right. Start with ZBrush. As you can see, it's a fingerprint magnet also, so I'm going to have to get some kind of screen protector. touch key Let's turn the brightness up it's a 75% brightness right now and that's apparently 100% Dynamesh at uh, 264. That was pretty quick. So, um, what I was talking about was I use the side button as a, a way to zoom and and uh, move the model uh, by programming as the alt key and with touch key for some reason when I hit alt it just leaves it on so I can move it but then I can't release it and zoom um, I don't know maybe I'll just figure out a different method to do this but it's right now it's pretty inconvenient um, other than that it seems to work <clears throat> see like I would normally there I would hold the uh, pen button as an alt and just move the model up so I can but that's not an option it's not as quick uh, for my workflow I'm hoping that I figure out another method
I'll go ahead and remesh, see how that works, see how long it takes. Not too bad, I guess. F considering it is uh, just the tablet portion currently, which um, wouldn't really matter so much when it's docked, I guess, because ZBrush isn't uh, graphic. Uh, the graphic card, it doesn't really rely on that. It relies on memory and processor, so. Uh, that's just a quick demo of that. Like I said, if you guys know of uh, way to get our dock working or to program the buttons on the pen that would help my workflow a lot let me go ahead and start <laughs> this theme is ridiculous let me go ahead and start photoshop for you guys Um, this is, uh, I already went and I went to edit, uh, edit preferences, experimental features, scale, user interface, 200%, um, because I'm going to show you what it's like when you don't do that, and it's really not usable. Let's see. The elements of the interface are not even they're just tiny tiny because of the uh, incredibly high resolution of the screen so oops so when you use Photoshop you're gonna want to go to edit preferences experimental features scale user interface and then restart it these settings to give you guys an example how we can see that it's um, just a US paper setting I'm going to show you a uh, lag on this brush that I was playing with earlier looks like the control key is still on for some reason why is the control key still on Yeah, I, I closed um, touch key and for some reason it left the control key as pressed down. So this isn't ideal. Um, there's so much to be worked out still it seems, but let me show you a demo of the brush. There's a bit of lag. And to be honest, when it, I'll show you with the uh, base hooked up, but from what I've noticed so far, it doesn't seem to really make a difference. Yeah, that's pretty substantial lag. Photoshop's always had a pretty heavy brush, brush engine, though. This brush is way faster. So, I, and then also I want to show you, if you go to the preferences, general, performance, it'll say that it's using the Intel HD Graphics 520, and then, you dock it. Ridiculous. It still says that until you close and then reopen the program because it has to reinitialize whatever the new hardware that uh, I didn't have when it was open, so now when you go to, good lord, 
edit preferences general performance it'll show the Nvidia um, but like I said I don't know if there's settings that I need to play with again same presets and that's the quicker brush let me find the one that we we're using before Yeah, there's still ridiculous lag. Um, so I don't know. I thought the graphics card was supposed to make a difference. It doesn't seem to. If anybody has any pointers with that, please let me know. Cause it's a uh, pretty disappointing. Some of the brushes are fast, and like I said before, the Photoshop brush engine is pretty heavy, but uh, with 8 gigs of RAM and a dedicated graphics card, I would think that it would perform better. Um, that's all for now, really. I, I got these pen tips also. I haven't really tried them out yet. I'll um, spend more time with them, do a review. I just want to give you guys a quick... Uh, example of the performance that it has, what to expect, um, I don't know, the, the hotkey experience, if anybody knows how to get um, our dock working I feel like that would be a better option so if you have any tips please let me know, I'm trying to love this, I, I really want to uh, make this my all-in-one daily PC, so far I hate the touchpad and I don't know if art-wise it's a very efficient um, piece of equipment. So, all right, that's it for now.